We're here in Berchtesgarden. We are at Lake Knigsee. We took the boat ride over here to the chapel. Okay, so we're here in Berchtesgarden. We are at Lake Knigsee. And there's a restaurant here and a little walking trail, so we're gonna check that out. So we got the Kaiser Schmar. It's fried dough. Um, they top it with like a powdered sugar and they give you applesauce and a fruit spread to go with it. Just a funnel cake. The softer? Yeah. It's pretty much dough. It's delicious. We've not had it yet, so. I could just eat it I think with you, Yeah, I think you'd dip it in the applesauce. I could do it without them. Mm. It's pretty good. Or maybe, uh, I guess you pour it since it's in a... You could pour it or there's a spoon here. Mm. Mm. We got the currywurst. It's always a staple for us. I got the pretzel with the vice first. Mm. Lucas learned that you have to cut this a certain way. You have to peel it. Yeah, you don't eat the skin. Yeah. What'd you get, fries? Um, What's this? Thomas. Thomas. So we're gonna walk on this little walking path. It's along the lake. It's about a half an hour walk. This place is so beautiful, and we're here in April, so I can't imagine what it'll be like in the summer, in the peak time of all the trees and leaves being green. I brought the carrier, but Griffin insisted to ride on Lucas's shoulders. I just love seeing snow-capped mountains especially when the bottom is so green. It's just so beautiful. inside the Bartoloma Chapel here. It's much smaller than I thought, because on the outside it looks really big, but it's actually pretty small. We take the boat back to Canixie and head on to the Gasthof. They have all these shops and they even have hotels and restaurants you can eat at right before you get on the boat or after you get off the boat. We're at our hotel for the next 
two days. It is super cute. Look at our view. Awesome. Stay tuned for our next video, our first day in a gas talk. So we're gonna go on a little hike. Uh, we're gonna hike to this bridge that's supposed to be really, uh, really beautiful. And I think it'll take us about 45 minutes. Let's hope. We're hiking in the Birches Garden National Park. We pretty much have this whole trail to ourselves. So this place makes me think of Yosemite. You know, when you're in the valley in Yosemite and you got El Cap and all the other surrounding mountains. So I, I, I get that vibe here while we're walking through this. I guess it's a valley between these two huge mountains. What is that, Griffin? Eagle. An eagle. An eagle. <laughs> so we're heading towards the Honga Brook. It says it's 30 minutes away still. Don't know how it's gonna go because it's already seven o'clock. We'll see. So we were on our way to try and make it to this bridge. But we got to a sign and it said 30 more minutes and it's like seven o'clock. It's just not gonna work out today, but we did find this waterfall. We're gonna let Griffin throw some rocks in the water. You gonna throw some rocks? Yeah. Where's the mountains? Daddy, my turn. Daddy, mommy, daddy. We found this little area that has some deer, like a little wildlife area. Griffin loves it. They also have this cool tower that you can go up and see the deer from up high and get a cool view of the mountains up there. We just finished our hike here in the Berkus Garden National Park. It was really beautiful. Mm -hmm. I think it's very similar to Yosemite. Yeah, National I said Park. Yosemite. Yeah. yeah. It's really cool. So now we're going to go try to find a restaurant that's still open because it's uh, <laughs> almost 8 o'clock. Yeah, I think it's 8.10. So if not, there's always McDonald's and Burger King. So we will see you guys on our next video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.